Hello guys, welcome back to Sim UK, welcome back to Dawn of Man. We are in the process of, I mean quite literally, this chap is building us a flint mine. It's the first time we've had one, I'm excited. Um, the workload is still too high. I mean, they can never be happy, can they, these blinking people? 250 is high. I understand that. I think we just need more people, and um, once we have more people, we'll be fine. But uh, as it is at the moment, you know, we are becoming a farming nation, a, a collection of farmers, if you will. And um, these are exciting times. There's actually not... I was going to say, there's not much uh, flint in there, but we don't know, I guess, until... Oh no, I Meg. Have you been out with the local girls again? Oh, you are a local girl. Whoops. Sorry. Um okay, I think you need to stay in your own little tent. We should have a sick tent. I'm gonna make a sick I can't do it now. Hopefully she won't infect everybody else. That's all I'm thinking. She's carrying the flint. It's quite an important resource. She's also got a bow. You know, there's lots of lots of reasons not to kill her. <laughs> In fact, I don't think you can, can you? You can't kill her. But she's resting. Hopefully she'll get better. Let's just say that at least. I think hopefully she'll get better. I think this is um, actually going to work quite well now. Everyone seems to be doing what they should be doing. Nice. It's built. So we can get three humans in there. And how do we... Oh, yeah. Unlimited. Yeah, just mine it till it's all gone. That sounds good to me. Just need some people to go over there and do it. Good stuff. We've got some flour here. The workload is too high. I know, I know, I know. We've got some cured meat. We don't have a lot, but we do have quite a bit of fish. Just trying to work out what's going on with the fish situation over here. That's mud. That should be fish. Why is no one fishing? What's over here? Plenty of fish there. So water and mud. Oh, okay. So we don't need an additional mud thing. So we get rid of that. And this one is just fish. Yeah. Okay. Well, that looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. I might just sort of say, well, someone come and fish here and someone come and fish here. And let's do one there as well. Just to boost the amount of fish that we have. So, uh... Alrighty. Who's in there? Well, there you are. Akadza. Other than being a bit miserable, she's doing really quite well. Uh, this is what I wanted to do. I wanted to turn this into a mine. So let's put that on the list of things to do. Because, you know, there's too many idle people already. I suppose they are working quite hard sort of setting up the uh, the uh, the fields for planting for, for this year. But, uh, I mean, that does. We've still got 12 grain from last year. So really and truly... That has transformed us. I mean, we've now got surplus food, and that never happens. The goats. Oh, sorry, I think. She died of an infection. She's got a bow, though, so could somebody come and get it? How oh, does everybody have a bow now? It looks like we do. Do you have a bow? Yeah, you do. We got a bow. You haven't got a bow? Oh, mate. Everybody's got bows these days. Okay, that's a bit of a shame. Uh, there's a dog. Okay, fine. Hopefully somebody will come and get her stuff. It's a good bow. It's, you know, still got a lot of life in it, that bow. Do you have a bow? Have you got a bow? Everybody has a bow. This is fantastic. This is what I wanted. This is what I always dreamed of. <laughs> Everybody has a bow. 
Hey, Bo. How you doing, Bo? That kind of bow. Anyway, right, concentrate. Um, we have no flint. This appears to be our biggest problem right now. How do I get... This is the question I need to figure out now, I suppose. How do I get people in there? How do I get people to go into the mine? Does anyone have the mine crafting? Planting, planting. Everyone has to plant right now. That's just the way it is, okay? So, is anybody mining? Right, okay. It's on the list of things to do. Basically, they're all so busy with the fields that they can't go and do anything else. But there we go. The planting is gone. I bet you the workload has dropped right down to 175. There you go. Brilliant. Oh, no. Gory cow has died of old age. Sorry to hear that. We're down to 14 people and the trader has arrived. Okay. Sir Trader, what do you have for us? Some more goats. Yeah, because we don't actually know how to catch any at the moment. We'll take the goats, we'll take the meat and we'll give you in return. We haven't got as many logs as we used to have. We need to start chopping down some trees and stuff again. Um, uh, yeah, that's, yeah, they are quite expensive, aren't they? I think maybe just one because we're a bit poor at the moment. Uh, and what is worth something? Axes are worth money. We can get rid of the bows, I suppose, because we've got an awful lot of... Get rid of some of these bifaces. Oh, went a bit over the top there. What's going on? Yeah, okay, I think we'll go for that. Good stuff. So we now have three goats. And I'm hoping they're going to procreate and, uh, yeah, that's going to, that's going to be awesome. What are you doing over here? Is he making the mine? Or you're mining? You're actually mining, but it doesn't look like that. So maybe what I need to do, maybe I've done this wrong. Oh, I didn't build the mine. Okay. Okay, I did that wrong. I didn't know you could actually mine that. Maybe we've only just unlocked the ability to do that now that we can mine underground because I'm pretty sure I couldn't do that before. I'm sure I tried to do that before. Anyway. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Is anyone going to come and get this flipping bow? Have you got a bow? Have you got a bow? Do you want a bow? I know you're young. Probably too young for a bow. You haven't got a bow. Come here and get this bow. And then get this Ibex. So pick up the bow. Pick up the... Whatever that was. Have you got a bow? Have you got a bow? Okay, don't worry. Nice. I think that's an axe. Pick up the axe. There's loads of water here. In, oh, come on. Come get the water. Well done. So, he's off to build the mine. Nobody's complaining about being overworked. This is great, great, great. Uh, we do have a, a rock pile store there. A dog or a... Yeah, it's a dog. That's cool. Just wandering around. Um, I think a lot of stone could come out of there. So I'm thinking, let's pop another rock pile there. And we'll say that oh, once that's built, we'll say all that's allowed to be stored there is flint. So we'll turn all this off. Hopefully that'll work as well as I plan it. Because what was happening before when I had storage outside of the main place is they just you know they'd be stood here looking for somewhere to store it there'd be room in the building next to them but they'd take it all the way over here and that was I think absolutely killing us there's a few little stutters 
and that bread's gone off. No big deal, no big deal. There we go, the mine is done. I'm not sure I know how to get people to go in the mine. We only have a small amount of flint, and I think that's probably still coming from over here. Or is it summer? Yay, it's summer. Summertime, summertime, summertime. So, oh, actually, that's interesting. So I think we've exhausted... There was an area up here where we were, where we were collecting uh, flint. And I think that opportunity has passed. Is that an apple tree? Oh, it's a cherry tree. There's a song about that as well. <laughs> I won't sing it. Um, collect harvest. Make it smaller. Just want someone to come here and. Oh, what's this? There's. Oh, yeah, there's a, um, what's that? Rye? That's rye. This is looking great. At the end of the summer, we'll be able to harvest that. And, uh, yeah, I think this is enough to sustain twice as many people as we have. We've got 18 now. Wow, 18 now. We've got seven female adults, three male adults. That's the most we've had, I think. That's the best balance we've had for a long time. Uh, 26. Okay, let's, I think, consider... popping another one down nice now I could upgrade these I might upgrade this one and this one what's cool about this by the way if you haven't seen this before which I haven't shown you but if you haven't seen it before is in order to upgrade this I mean normally in RTS games they come along throw some hammers at it make some noise and then it pops up into a new thing this has to be pulled down rebuilt into a new hut and I think that's a great feature that's where attention to detail has really really ticked the boxes here we go this one's being pulled down so they've taken they're starting to take the outside off new one going up and this is the time to do it in the summer before we start harvesting well, look at that, we've got loads of fruit and stuff out here. Uh, let me slow down a second. Let me get a workplace and say, yeah, I just want you to come and get all this loveliness. One person, grab it all. Excellent. Speed up. It's also cool that the kid, see that, a kid has taken on that job. So just Torgal, that's Torgal's job there is. He needs to collect as many berries and stuff as he can before the end of the summer. Isn't that fantastic? I think that's really cool. Reminds me of my childhood, that does, really. Where I was given tasks to do. Simple tasks, you know, not, not stressful, difficult tasks. But, you know, that was my task, my responsibility. And I, I don't know if I appreciated it so much then, but I certainly do appreciate it now as an adult try and teach my own children that kind of early ethic that early work ethic now that's only half full I uh, missed it that's hardly got anything on it at all and that's got nothing on it at all okay so I don't need to put any more in we've got quite a few flinging about um, but we'll see how full they get because last year I didn't have this work area set up so now we've got a work area, a maximum of five people. Um, it should work. And hopefully all of these will be full of straw, because last year we, we left it all just strewn all over the field. Most irritating. I think we're at a point where defences are applicable. Um, it's not so much I don't think we can fight raiders off. It's more the sense that you know, I don't want I don't want this to come and damage all the stuff we've worked so hard to achieve, you know? 
So I think I'm going to start working on that. We are going to need a lot of trees. So I think probably we'll send some people over here. Maybe rebuild that tent that we had. And just get them sort of chopping trees down and... Presumably dragging it back to the main base. I think that's what I'd want them to do. We'll, we'll decide further later on. So we've got some sticks and wood and stuff here. Nobody seems to come and get this. Maybe it's because we've got plenty. Um, flint still seems to be going up, but I don't see any evidence of anyone actually working in there, which is going to get flint. Okay, so yeah, they do. Right, okay, that's how it works then. They walk up, they go in there, they get the flint, and they come back out again. There's another one here. Certainly that's more productive than whatever the heck we were doing before. What's interesting is they're not putting the flint here. I think I might get rid of this one. I think I'll get rid of this one and just ask them to put it all here. And we'll just say, yeah, just flint for now. Just fill that up with flint. That could be the flint store. Meet the flint store. Meet the flint store. It's a modern stone family. It's only the second time I've sung that since I started playing this game. I think that's an achievement in itself. Bison. I wonder if you can domesticate young bison. I know you can do cattle. Maybe this qualifies as cattle. We're a long way off that. Cattle, donkey, horse. I'd love a horse. Can you ride the horses? That would be brilliant. That would be brilliant. I'm getting into the exciting side of this game now. Really exciting side. What's happened here? We've got no mud. What's going on with the mud situation then? Somebody stopped collecting mud? Seems like they have. Doesn't help anybody, does it? Mud is really important now. It never used to be, but now it is. Let's have a second workplace here. And we'll just pop that there, and it's just mud. We just want mud. Mud, 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 mud. hundred percent of the population so we've got 18 people I want 18 mud that seems fairly fair okay the summer is nearly up all of that has been gathered I'm so impressed he's done a fantastic job there all of that has been gathered touche there's a bit more there that we could have grabbed but uh, that's the summer over it's time ladies and gentlemen oh, we've nearly got enough knowledge it's time to harvest. This is the most exciting time of year for me. You can see these little trees that were here have all grown up into proper big trees now. Which is great. That gives us something to harvest. And here we have nearly got our fifth hut. We have the capacity for 28 people. And the trader's back. Well, the trader turns up a lot when you're doing well, doesn't she? Hello, trader. What have you got for us? Whoa. Oh. I'm feeling a bit flush today. A little bit. We'll have some steaks. Uh, we'll have some of your linen cloth. And go on, we'll have another goat. A sheep domestication. Oh, no, we can't afford that. That's way too much. That's 188. Okay. That's quite a bit more expensive than I was expecting, I'll be honest. Um, okay. Is this surplus? Settlement stock. So this is stuff other than what people have in their possession, right? Is that correct? Let's just check that. How many bows do we have? 22. Okay, so if I look at her, it says 12. So these are 12 in addition to the ones that we have. So that's cool. I can actually use this to trade with. I was thinking I was literally taking it out of people's hands. What happened there? We'll take the wool. In fact, I don't think we can do anything with the wool yet. So that might be 
pointless, but we'll, we'll take it anyway. No, that's getting ridiculous, isn't it? Getting ridiculous, just wasting money. The wool's quite cheap. We'll keep the wool. I'd love to get sheep on board. 119, I think we can do that. Uh, let's not give away our food. That's probably quite a silly thing to do. Logs, I think we need. By face value has gone right down. I think the flint knives now are probably taking over. I, we haven't hunted an animal for maybe a whole year. I don't think we have, have we? We haven't needed to. It's a nice place to be. Uh, bone harpoon. That seems to be the best thing to fish with, other than a fishing rod, which I know you can make, but I don't know when. What do we need? Three more. That's it. Job done. Excellent. That's another goat. Are we getting any milk out of this goat? Yeah! Awesome! The workload is too high. Be quiet. Structure built. Five times huts. Some of our people have no warm clothing. Well, how has that happened? Are you the clothing people? Yes, you are. So, let's just check this. What's the deal with the warm clothing? Let's whack it right up. Here you go, 175? No, okay, 150 then. 150. Let's boost that up. We are absolutely flying now. Feeling very self-sufficient. Right, okay, decision. Palisades, sheep. Oh, that's really tempting, isn't it? Sheep. Clothing. I think our people would like clothing. But our people would also like sheep. But what's the point in having sheep if you don't have clothing? Plus, this means more work, or this just means better quality. The water, I think, we're coping with just fine. We never have a water problem. So I think we're going to have to go with Palisades. Done. Decision made. Fortification is now unlocked. Wonderful. Defensive. What do we got here? Watchtower, gate, and a Palisade. Yeah, okay, I'll I tell you what. <laughs> because they're so upset, because they're so upset about the high workload that we have whilst we're doing, whilst we're harvesting, um, I'm going to wait until maybe the winter is a good time to build the Palisades because all the work should be done and everybody should be, you know, feeling cold. So if you want to warm up, you go and build some Palisades and away you go. That seems to be working a lot better. Let's just see if they leave all the rest of this on the floor. I hope they don't. Oh, there's a storm coming. There's a storm coming! What is this? Blueberries, nice. A new human was born. Ability to name your characters. That's one thing I want to happen. Right, now look. They are just leaving it all on the floor again. Oh no, that kid's coming to pick it up. To be fair, he's the only one that's doing it. And now he's bored. Is it just that there's too many jobs to do? Is that what the problem is? And they're not prioritising it? We're in fall, we're not in winter yet. A new animal was born! A goat! Oh wow, we got a baby goat! That's so cool! I can't see it because the, the mummy goat is feeding it, I think. There he is. Underneath all of that, there's a, there's a new goat. I'm wondering if I should put another hearth in. It never seems particularly overloaded, but... Just for the convenience of the locals, I don't know. But maybe when I get rid of this hut and increase our uh, 
these ones I can I can put some more down the sides or something like that I don't know we'll see we'll see are they picking it up nobody's picking up this stuff off the uh, off the fields again why are you prioritizing you're prioritizing the wrong things everybody look at all the stuff on the floor that we can eat that you're just leaving behind to be fair we've got plenty of grain haven't we all right, let's look at the workload it's only 132%, but nobody upon nobody is currently tasked with picking up the stuff. I don't understand why they don't pick up this stuff. It's just going to go off. Is it because we've got like so much of it that you just don't think it's it's important come on some of our people have no warm clothing right, I'm gonna set the sticks to unlimited because we are a bit shy on sticks 15 is not a lot we've got so many logs and so few sticks not the ideal situation. Hang on a minute. We seem to have uh, two work locations right next to each other there. That was weird. Okay, so that's cut down trees. I'm going to cancel that for now. I don't think we need to cut down any more trees at the moment. We do need some warm clothing though, so I'm hoping that's going to happen. The work area that's for collecting tannin I think that's okay that's the sticks that's food in the in the summer yeah look see I've not got the the warm clothing maybe I should just change this and you just focus on clothing maybe that's the way to do it New human was born. Fantastic. What's wrong with you? Are you cold? No, you're seriously miserable. Okay. Some people are just miserable. Ask my wife. But I'm bumch. Uh, I think we could do with giving the uh, the animals a bit more stuff. Guys, people. I know you're all miserable in that, but come on. I don't understand why I'm having to like manually get them to come and pick this stuff up. There's definitely a bit of an issue with the AI prioritization, I think, because this makes no sense to me at all. I know we've got loads of grain, loads of bread. Let's maybe set the bread limit to 150%. Can I do that for each one? Okay, one of them sets all of them. Grain, I think we're going to set this not to 100%. I think we're just going to say constant. Just keep going. Nice. Well, that's another winter. We didn't really expand a huge amount, I suppose. But um, we have done really rather well, I feel. Um, certainly. Just going to the hearth. Why are you going to this hearth here? This is really starting to bug me. Right, get rid. There's no longer a hearth over here, okay? That doesn't exist either. All right? All the storage and all the stuff happens inside... Here. No more walking 70 miles to get to the fire. It's ridiculous. It stops today. 
Maybe later, when the developers have made you more intelligent, then, then perhaps I will allow you a hearth outside of the home. Where is he going? Oh, it's demolishing it. Cycling it, I should say. It's cool that you get to keep all the stuff. I like that. That's a good thing. But we do need warm clothes. Why don't we have enough warm clothes? Are we lacking something? Oh, nuts. Are we out of animal hide? We are. We don't have any animal hide. So I've been so busy enjoying... <laughs> enjoying things. Is there an old goat? Old male. That's an old male. I just clicked on him. What happened? Okay. Do it for the slaughter, mate. Sorry, dude. Do we have any other old... No, young, young, adult, adult, young. Okay. Sorry. Sorry, goatee. Christmas dinner calls for you. Chickens. That's what we need in this game. Chickens. He's like, I thought you said that was for slaughter. Nobody slaughtered me yet. Oh, God, that came out of nowhere, didn't it? Right, well, he wasn't expecting it, but there he goes. It's been done. That gives us some raw meat and some raw skin. We are going to have to hunt to get the skin until we unlock sheep. And then once we have sheep, we won't need food's going off. We've got so much of it. Once we have sheep, we won't need um, animal hide anymore because we'll have what we need. Oh, no, no, no. Don't cut down the pear tree. Is that a pear tree? Is that a partridge? We get rid of that one as well. And I'm going to put a second stable in here. Yeah, I know some of us don't have warm clothing. I'm sorry. It's my fault. We didn't. We didn't go hunting this year. It was a bit lazy of me. Speaking of lazy, is anyone going to pick up this stuff? Where are you going? You're going to get sticks. Sod the si sticks. What's this set to? Unlimited. Okay, let's just set it to. 50. I don't know if that even makes sense. I still don't understand quite how that work system works. Two new humans have joined the settlement. Fantastico. Back to 23. We're as strong as we've ever been, if not stronger than we've ever been. This is good stuff. Survive the winter. We did it, guys. We did it in style. Well, we... I think that's probably the wrong explanation. I love how the goats walk out of the building. Look at that. We didn't do it in style because nobody had any clothes. So the primary focus, I think, is to get some animal skins in. Not just for the fact that we need clothes, but also animal skins build sledges. Um, there's, a, there's a lot of reasons for this. So whilst I'm thinking about it, I am going to keep clicking on the wrong things until I click on the right thing. We didn't get any palisades up. I noticed that. That's weird. Uh, so we are going to build a few of these. Before I forget. It's weird how you can just put them on top of each other like that. I don't understand that. Uh, so we'll say three more. But obviously... We'll say four more. But obviously in order to... Uh, to even build these, we're going to need some some animal hide. So a bit of hunting is going to have to reoccur next year. Guys, I'm going to save it there. Thank you for watching. Take care of yourselves. Until next time, goodbye.